I'm gonna look. Mm. Yeah. Oh, wait. Where's that thing to oh. oh, I have to open it. Can you open it up? Mm. Mm -hmm. You turn on your volume? Mm -hmm. Turn it off. Oh. <clears throat> she get up and left me. I'm Domini. Wagwan Queen. June. Fry planting. How are you, sir? No, sir. Marine. Good night. Ioni, Wagwan. Mm -hmm. Facebook just come off so I find for what the hell wrong yeah. with it? I'm fine about cause it just cut up your phone just go right out. Yep, yeah, it did it to me when I was first trying to go on. Let yeah, me don't know what happened. What a guan! Happy Saturday! Happy Saturday! Happy Saturday! Happy Saturday! How are you all doing? Walk one, rope and come in. Welcome, you have to come. Come chit chat with you guys. It's a rainy and cold night. Mm -hmm. Rainy and cold night. Walk one, kings and queens. Big up, big up. Mm -hmm. Rainy and cold. Welcome, if you can't give yourself a good trouble with you guys. On a mind. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Uh huh. We're, we're not going to be too bad. What's up, man? We're um, trying to be here. I'm having. Malibu coconut rum with um, cranberry and um, watermelon and pineapple juice. Oh. It's all mixed in here. Mine's. Me mix up so much sitting till it look like dirty water. I don't even remember what mine is. You don't know where you put it nope. up here? Oh. Oh, oh. All I know is it tastes good. We'll try getting back in a Facebook so we can see on a comment. Yeah? Bear with me. Bear with me on a rope and come in, have a nice seat. Anywhere you want to sit. Just sit down. Just make yourself at home. Just pop a squat. Mm -hmm. Pop a squat. Pop a squat. Pop a squat if you like. Yes. Just make yourself at home. Mm -hmm. A long time. It's been a while. It's been a minute. Yeah, since we come out when we got the nail salon. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't come out for praise and worship. We came up and party. We come out and party. Last Saturday. Yeah, last Saturday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're busy. Very, very busy. I understand. So I don't have to bear with me. Me I dying for do a master baker. Me don't do it today. I'm end up on the road. It's very hard. You know, me need to me. Yes? Trust and believe me. Yes. So, but me want you know no master baker. And trust me, master baker, I come. She I come. Me I try very hard. This weekend coming to come out with a master baker. Because I know me have the master baker fund them out there. Yes. Me I got try and come out this coming weekend. The next week, me not going to be, not going to be home. Yeah, me I go, I go visit my family them for Thanksgiving. I'm not hosting Thanksgiving this year. Yeah, me I got somebody yard. Some, some family yard. Yeah, make them cater to me. Yeah, that's not me. Now, what I think, oh. Family, if you not watch me, nobody thinks I'm here come, come peel nothing. Or help with nothing. Yeah, yeah. Oh God, I, I strictly nothing. come here come. For come enjoy myself and eat up on the food. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not come talk about for peel nothing. Huh. I'm not in it. Ah. <laughs> you know, say, you, you know, say, uh, if I need your help, you have to help more. I'm such a sucker. You are. God, me can't be mean. No. Ah, uh, yeah, man, me know me gonna say, say yes. You need, you need any help? Yeah, man, I saw me. Can't. She's not even gonna let them say, "Can you help me?" She'll go say, "Do you need me to do anything for you?" I true. <laughs> I see a way she'll go say. I true, man. Me such a damn sucker. 
Jackie Ware. That's why I run up my mouth now when we go at the She has a big thing. S on her forehead for suckers. <laughs> suckers for real and then know it too. They appear and around they take me, advantage of it. Around me, around half my mouth. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Not on the other side. Please. But I was spoiled, my don't. Yeah? Yeah. Me not gonna lie. Me spoil, but me is not a brat. Yeah? Me is not a brat. There's a difference. Yeah, man. Me is not a brat. Mm-hmm. So tonight, we come to talk about what the topic what we things we've learned things we've learned since we've been on social media now for four years mm -hmm. and i hope some of you guys have um similar experience and you know this is just our experience these are our experiences ours, on, ours, on facebook ours nobody else but ours all right so that's and, a disclaimer this is what we chocolate and vanilla have experience start, yes study in social and media learned and learn on social on media. social media since yeah. we've been on here now for four years you know not, not everybody has to agree with me and that is fine you know because we are all different people we experience and see things differently you know what I mean so we're right and you're wrong are you wrong and we're right i just what we observed right That's so right. you have your list i do hold on you have to make a list you know mm -hmm. and um just before we forget we're still gonna come out we're still gonna do our christmas giveaway don't you worry we had the first one um last week yeah we had the first one last week where we gave away um you know clogs yeah so um we'll, we'll be back with more surprises and of course we had mentioned the list of people that we want to support this year um people that we um admire and um that supports us on social media um we're not here to tell anybody who they should and should not support these are just the people that we support across social media and and uh, have mutual respect for right um so I can't can't pin it, so when we're ready for it, I'll put it back in. There. Okay, oh, fine. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm ready. ready yes, yeah, so ready. we're ready. Um, they're in no particular order. None whatsoever. None whatsoever. These are just things that we have learned since we've been on social media. Um, I I'll go for. Uh, you want me to go first or you want to go first? Because I love semi me, me chat I'll, too much. I'll go first. All right, go first. All right. One now. Go first. All right. Mm. People talk about people look like dundos, yet they bleach to look as close to a dundos as possible. That's what you have observed. That's what uh, I've observed on on social media. Okay. Are you offended that they call they, they use the word dundos? No, because I know I'm not. Okay. Just one. I just sure. think it's kind of. I, I I laugh after it. I think it's stupid. I think they're dumb. They make they look ignorant. Okay. Yeah, All right. They really do. Okay, me just want to make sure you're good. Yeah, man, me good. Okay, all right. Um, you can meet good and genuine people on social media. Let nobody fool you. We have met some amazing, amazing. people mm -hmm. off of social media. Let me tell you. People that are just so genuine, that genuinely love and support us. So let no one fool you that everybody on social media are evil or have um, hidden agendas or, you know, trying to get clout. Um, don't let people fool you with that. There are some amazing people that we have met on social media, um, just on social media, and some that we've met off of social media. In and person. In, in person. And these people remain um to be a part of our lives yes 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 mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> all right people disagree with you they look and they love to throw shade when people disagree with you they love to throw shade you have learned that on social i learned that in social media when they disagree with you they love to sh throw shade meaning what meaning for example if if i say the sky is blue and they don't agree that the sky is blue them curse me and go up under me and all kinds of things. Okay. All right. right. Got it. You can also meet some of the fakest people on social media. So I also want to make that clear. 
that you can meet some of the nicest people on social media as well as you can meet some of the fakest people but you have to make that detection really early that way you don't fall into relationships that are toxic and um, people who will try to record you and set you up stuff like that you gotta be you got to um, have a sense of knowing when people are real and and believe me if you pay attention you'll see the signs early really early yes thank you so much rosemary Edward, thank you rosemary Edward. thank yes. you some people see the signs and they chose to ignore ignore the red signs flags. yeah the red flags yeah. you understand but um you have to make an early detection um people that are push too hard yes push up on you too hard uh, being overly aggressive in trying to get to know you i believe that things should happen naturally um so those are some of the signs yes mm -hmm. good night good jennifer night, dawkins good night, good night. Jo um janet cooks good night for, to whomever um just enter the the live good welcome evening, good, good evening. evening good evening we're just here talking about some of the things that we've learned since we've been on social media for four years things we've observed things that we've seen happen you know happen things that we've learned from yes mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. vanilla people are not happy with their own body yet they make fun of other people's body so, so for example they make changes to them their body because obviously if you're making a change to your body you don't like something about yourself yet the somebody who loves themselves and loves their body they make fun of them yeah insecure so you yes you're somebody not. who's insecure yes, yes insecure okay yes people on social media have learned that they will undercover hate you for your numbers and for your views we've have learned that mm -hmm. being on social media you don't have to do anything to anyone they watch your growth and if they're not growing um, at, a, at, a, at the level that you they feel like they're not moving they will get envious of you for that mm -hmm. when you have no control over people that naturally gravitates towards you based on your you know personality or whatever it is yeah they they will um, develop bad mind towards you for that they will even accuse you of buying followers mm. I don't know I don't know the process in doing that. That's yeah. never a thought in our heads um, as, as far as I didn't even know. I've learned that on social media that that's, um, that's a possibility to buy yeah. followers. Yeah, I didn't yes. know that either. But that's, I... Good night, Shernet. Good night. <laughs> Kim, Nicole, Allison, good night. Social media is not a real p place. True. Yeah, that's true. Rose Edwards, good night. Waverly Nicole, Nichols, good night. Stacy Campbell, Campbell, big, big up big yourself. Big How are you doing, Queen? Big up. Or right, your turn, Vanilla. All right. <clears throat> you have to be careful showing your family on social media because they will be dragged through the mud. That is absolutely true. They will be dragged through the mud. And Even though they're not normally on social media, they have nothing to do with people's disagreements, that they get dragged into it unnecessarily, even though family should be off. And off. that is one reason why Vanilla, from the get-go, decided that she would not blog, blog from her house. We would blog from my house because my daughter has a place of her own and it's just Mike and I. And I still uh, have kids at my And house, she so. still have um, her kids... Um, at her home, so we made the decision from um, Jump. from Drum Street yeah. that I would be vlogging from my house and not Vanilla's house because she don't want her kids. You know, they have friends and they're in and out. She don't want them to be on camera or um, try to restrict them from moving around freely because be, be, because of the fact that people might see them on camera and try to come at her kids. And I respected that from the get go. Yep. So that is why mo when when we vlog, Vanilla is always at my house, and she just lives seven minutes away from me. So 
Um, Less if I it. catch the lights right. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. So that's why I, we always vlog from my house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not that Vanilla lives outside. I no, don't have I don't live outside. Yeah. And to vlog from Vanilla's house, that would be one more trace in Pantapo. Right. So wait. Right. <laughs> You understand? Oh, but I guess I'm going to be my house either. <laughs> right, that's true. One more thing that for Target to about. You understand? So I don't know who for house it would be, but it wouldn't be mine. <laughs> so we try to limit it, you know, <laughs> limit certain things. All right, my Your turn. turn. Don't play. Don't play your lifestyle as much as possible. Because if you... Because... You will become a target if you display too much. Mm. I've learned that on social media. Downplay. Yes, it's sad, but it is the truth. It is sad, but it is the truth. And that's why a lot of times when we travel, we show minimal amount of things. Um, stuff that we do, we try to keep it at the minimal right yes because you will be targeted mm -hmm. yes yep <laughs> your yep. turn all right people take things on social media way too far mm -hmm. way too far you calling somebody's job for them to lose their job you making threats against somebody you threatening bodily harm to somebody that's so unnecessary. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Yeah. Keep major moves to yourself. Not everyone is going to be happy for you. And they'll try everything to ruin those opportunities for you. Mm -hmm. So that's why we try to keep things to ourselves. Yep. Yes? Because... You can't come out and really talk about your opportunities because you then going to be a target. Right. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yes. Your Not opportunities, your yeah. major accomplishments, you have to yes. keep all of that. Yes, here. because people aren't going to be happy for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We've learned that. Yes. Mm -hmm. Big up Rose Kitchen. Big, big up Rose Kitchen and Vlog. Big up yourself. All right. Things people say on social media are made up to make others look bad. They tell lies. There's, um, they try and degrade the person in all kinds of ways to make people look bad. Make people show, come out in a bad light. All right. We knew right off the get-go that our businesses wouldn't um, depend on our platform. Mm -hmm. We made that decision. Be because the thing is, we see how people like to defame people. Yeah, we learned that right out the gate. So if you can help it, if you can help it, that's the underlying word. Some people, their business depends on social media. We knew we wouldn't need our businesses to depend on our platform because we have a separate, separate Facebook for our business. Right, Biz, um, it's a business account. Run the ads through Facebook because we knew that we whomever is gonna see us as enemies, they're gonna try to go off of our businesses. So we made a conscious decision that we we're not gonna do that. We want people who even our enemies to support us, not knowing that they're supporting us. Mm -hmm. So if you can help it, try not to. Let your business depend on your platform or uh, on social media. Yes. Mm -hmm. People think that they are the best thing since sliced bread. Mm -hmm. People think that they are the best thing since sliced bread. So nobody can't do things like them. They are the best at everything that they do. Um, you know, it, it's... Man. It, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to elaborate that. some more. So, for example, um, I'm, I'm trying to think of an example um, of, of something I've seen where, all right, we'll use Master Baker as an example. Master Baker comes out here 
and Master Baker, even though Master Baker doesn't do this, but I'm going to use Master Baker as an example, thinks that she is the funniest person on social media. Even though there are other people out there who are funny, but she acts like she's, there's nobody like her. Own. Exactly. You, people were just super self exalt. Uh, yes, absorbed. and make themselves yeah. look better than they really are. That's true. You have a lot of that. We've learned that on social media. Yes. Um, people will undercover compete with you. I've observed that on social media. People that you think you're cool with, they will undercover compete with you. Mm -hmm. I don't see the necessity in that, but some people... That's just, uh, I've learned a lot of traits since I've yes. been on social yes. media. And I learned a lot yeah. about people. And a lot about people. Yes. Yeah. People will undercover, mm -hmm, compete with you when, when you don't have the least thought about being no, in a competition. To you, there's no competition. There's no competition, but people will take it upon themselves to want to compete with you. We've yeah. learned that since we've been on social media. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Okay. You have to be careful who you talk to on the phone because you might be recorded. Absolutely. I true. am very skeptical on who I talk to on the phone. I limit. Um, I am not comfortable talking to a lot of people on social media. And if anybody tries to bring anything negative to me, I would hang up. Yes. I would. It's better you don't I'm engage. Not, I'm not engaging in all. any negativity with nobody on social media. Um, it's it better happening. not to engage because what I've realized too, you can have a simple conversation with people on social media and what they'll do, they will trim and fit together slice and, and slice and yes. dice and fit things together to portray you as a bad person. So to prevent all of that, which is like a no-no. Or <laughs> they only play one side of the recording and don't play what they say. Exactly. And one person cannot uh, have a conversation. conversation. True. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so we're just telling you the things that we've learned since we've been on social media because we like to learn. We we like to observe and 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 learn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Your turn. It's my turn. Yeah. I was the one. Oh, no. the, okay. Sorry, sorry. I learn I've learned that social media that on social media, bad mind is very, very active each and every day. Mm -hmm. Yes, true. it never cease. Bad mind is a, cons it's, it's a disease on social media. Mm -hmm. I've always heard people talking about bad mind growing up as a child and Bad mind this and bad mind that, but I've never witnessed it until I've been on social mm. media. Yes, mm -hmm. uh, on the level that it's at. I've been promoted on job. I know that people have been jealous. You understand? Mm -hmm. Yes, but not to the level of what it, of is. What it is on social media. Yeah. It's like people will literally hurt you and set you up to get hurt because the level of bad mind that them have mm -hmm. for people. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's like a trend. Yes, you're right. Your turn, Vanilla. Okay. People love to prove everything they do and say on social media. Like their word isn't good enough. I'm sorry. I'm not going to, if I say something and you don't believe me, that's on you for not believing what I'm telling you. But I'm not going to come out here and prove Everything I say or do, it's not happening. I'm not going to do it. No, my I word, don't think it's necessary. My words should be good. Should be good. Absolutely. Yes, I'm not coming out here to prove anything to no. anyone on social media. No, nope. I'm not going to do that because I remember when we just started vlogging, people said that my house was Vanilla's house. Yes, yeah. and you think I would go and get the title of my house and come out here and put it up on social media? No. I'm not, taxes. Let, or I'm not letting anybody at all have that type of control no. over me. Because, first of all, I knew that there were people who actually knew me in real life watching me. 
that knows that it's my home. Mm -hmm. You understand? You And I know within myself, it's my own. So if you want to mm -hmm. give it to my friend, she's my friend, give it to her. I'm not going to come out here and prove Anything. that it's not her, that it's not hers. No, it's not that serious. Right. I know it's mine. Right. <laughs> you know? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's my turn? Yeah. You have to keep reminding me. I'm oh, sorry. Your turn. <laughs> People will want you to swim across the ocean for them, but they will not or won't jump over, over a puddle for you. Mm. Yes? Let me repeat that. People will want you to swim across the ocean for them, but they're not willing to jump over a little puddle for you. Mm. You understand? Mm -hmm. That's what I've observed on social media. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They love, you have, what I've learned on social media is you have people who love to cuss people but can't handle it when they're the one that's being cussed out. True. They can, uh, they always they love They can dish the, it out but they, but can't, they can't take, take it. it. Right. That's true. Yeah, they just yes, I've observed that. Observed that too. Yeah, true. Mm hmm. God, the list so long, man. I think remember what we did. Social media is loaded with compulsive liars who do not believe people pays attention to details. They play on the on. They play on the hopes of you having amnesia so they'll come and say one thing mm -hmm, and then couple lives it's a different story they totally forgot contradict and contradict what they've said but we pay attention to details mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. very very true yes they, and and i'm sure a lot of their followers caught them in numerous amount of lies but the love and support, they don't want to call them out or they're afraid of being blocked. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. But there are a lot of liars on social media. Yeah. Mm -hmm. People love to say they want peace, but are involved in all the mix-ups. You have people who come out here and cry peace. And next thing you know, their name is all over social media in pure negativity. That's your observer. That's my, that's my opinion. Okay. All right. Peep, some people portray to be loved and more famous than they actually are. Some of them act like them are Michael Jackson, them are Beyonce. Oh my God, stop it. <laughs> stop it. Mm -hmm. Stop. Mm -hmm. Stop it. You understand? The story they gave, not even the way, way, way famous, more famous vloggers, you know, would make that such a claim. Right. You know? Stop it. Nah. Right. <laughs> Go ahead, Vanilla. All right. If you love and support, if you love and support certain people, then you become a target on social media. That is absolutely true. Yes, that I've is, observed that too. That's mm -hmm. happened to us. People take social media way too serious. Yes, we laugh at a lot of things because we think it's hilarious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But some people take it way, way too serious and personal mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. all right there are a lot of panhandlers on social media that is there true. are a lot of panhandlers on social media well beg the head the skin off of your, your body yes mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're talking about the things that we have observed and what we've learned since we've been on social media yes our opinions mm-hmm People on social media use the word friendship way too loosely. Way, way 
too loosely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. People will support you with an ulterior motive. And as soon as they get what they think that they want, they turn against you. That is true. We'll witness that over and over and over again. Yes. Your best friend on social media today can be your worst enemy the next day. That's mm -hmm. what we have observed, observed being on social media. Mm -hmm. Yep. And my, my, my next one is kind of similar mm -hmm. from that. Um, people will turn on you for content. Will. Just for content. Just for content. Yes, they might really like you, but they're going to turn on you. Just for, for content. content. Yes. My other one is trust no one. And I'm going to leave it at that. <laughs> okay. All right. My next one is people will think when they make a change for the positive. Everyone needs to jump in line and follow. Yes, that's true. It's kind of like you have a smoker who quits smoking. And all of a sudden, everyone that smokes is the nastiest human being on mm -hmm. planet Earth. They, they feel as though if they made a change, then automatically you should just jump on board and fall in line. Yeah. And it doesn't work like that. Nope. Nope, sure doesn't. <laughs> Laurel Guy Gibson, big up yourself. <laughs> big up yourself. All right, Vanilla. Your turn. You're... No, I just said trust. Uh -uh, oh, oh, I went. Oh, okay. People will make up fake stories all in the name of contents. Yes. Mm -hmm. People will make up fake stories. All in the name of contents. Okay. All right. My next one. People will come out to use God's name as cover-up. Then, while throwing shade and judging others in the same breath. I've seen it multiple times. Yes. True. Seen it multiple times. Talking about God and all of that. And then, in the same conversation judging people as though they know them and know their hearts mm -hmm. yes and cover all of that up under the name of jesus yeah. yes mm -hmm. yes <laughs> yes okay my turn yes people will threaten you with lawsuits uh lawsuits to scare you forgetting there are numerous evidence of them out there in trying to bring you down. In trying to bring down them. Hold on. Okay. May I okay. repeat it for them? All right. All right. That one you're worth repeating. Yeah. People will threaten you with a lawsuit to scare you, forgetting, forgetting there are numerous evidence of them out there in trying to bring down the same person they want to sue. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. True that. Very true. Mm -hmm. Yes. Very, very true. Yes. Because there is another recent threat. I'm going to put them on the ground and talk. I'm going to parch my words. There's a recent lawsuit geared towards the L. To the To the A. A. To the D. To the Y. With the V. At the end. At the end. And the person, nothing, no member, said that they put our boutique out there with our clothes and everything trying to bring down our business. Put the name of, of her mm -hmm. significant other exactly. business out exactly. there. Exactly. Look, I'm so partner. I'm straight as it is. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes. Mm-hmm. All right, go on, Vanilla. <laughs> People think that speaking well or constructing a system... Uh, I'm sorry. Let me start over. People think 
that speaking well and constructing a sentence is defined as being educated. That is true. That is true. I think that one deserves one more. Yes, read it I again. I think I need to say that one there again. Yes. People think that speaking well or being able to construct a sentence is defined as you being educated. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're the one here. Mm -hmm. People lie about potential opportunities on social media. People lies about potential uh, potential opportunities on social media and then forget and hope you forget the lies they told. For example, me love the example Saying their products will be on Amazon. It's not on there. Saying their products will be on Walmart shelf. It's not on there. I went to Walmart up to this morning and I didn't see it. Saying they will be on a TV show called Locked Up in America. Still not on the TV show. Stop lying about potential opportunities. We remember. Okay. And we'll remember the ones them for next year. Mm -hmm. Copy. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Pop. Hit. People lie that they're in law school. Stop it. You're not going to no damn law school. You have Stop. to get a bachelor's yeah. degree before you can go to law school. Uh -huh. Just and they you hope know. you will forget all the numerous lies they told. Because they want to even up themselves with other people who are getting opportunities. You know your damn lie. Tap it. Huh. Mm. Master Baker just come out. <laughs> My name plan for she come, you know. Can she show up? Damn. Master Baker, go back in. Go back in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's stop it. <clears throat> stop it. Mm-hmm. All right, my turn? Yes, your turn. All right. People think that being pretty is an accomplishment, not realizing there are pretty toilets out there. I agree. I agree. Me that prefer fit. You want to be a gay? Me would prefer to look like Oprah and have a li our lifestyle. Than to be pretty like who were and be broke and mm. stagnant. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Can't find nobody where I want to say. Mm. Pretty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Not realizing they have pretty toilets out there. That's mm -hmm. what Vanilla just said. Let me repeat it. Me not say re-inerate you. Re-inerate. Re-iterate. Yes. <laughs> there are pretty toilets out there that people do do in. Uh -huh. All right. Mm -hmm. Master Baker, go back in, no man. Jesus, make you stand Go back in. <sighs> go ahead, Vanilla. It's my your turn. I'm my turn. Yep. Oh, God. Watch them. No, but they are Master Baker. Yes, watch them. Uh -uh. Every damn bad behaving master baker. Go in, man. All right, which part me there? People will shade you in a minute, just like I did. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying, people will shade you in a minute. Just like I did, honey. Mm -hmm. Like Master Baker did. <laughs> you understand? Just like Master Baker did. Mm -hmm. your turn. All right. We would rather be ugly and rich than pretty and worthless. Let me repeat that one more time. We would rather be ugly and rich than pretty and worthless. 
and stagnant. What is in America? Oh, what Master Baker, stop it, no man. You must see me a trophy. Stop. Master Baker, stop it. <sighs> what is in America? All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> People will lie about their financial status, not realizing being wealthy is a lifestyle. And there is no need to convince anyone that you are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, make sure when you make six figure on a six finger. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I hear toes. Power one foot. Mm -hmm. Master B, shut up. Huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So now talk about success. Mm -hmm. And I'll go one cake here, be three months. <laughs> Master B, stop it now. God. All right, Vanilla, your turn. People mm. want us to have the same love we have for Auntie Donna for them, but they don't realize that love, that there are different levels of love. That is so true. That is so true. Yes, and we get 